Um, we're going to Pooh's Pets. Sorry, it's dark outside. So guys, I think Pooh's Pets will open today. So you want to 
gonna check. She's gonna explain. She's gonna explain everything for you. Okay. Because we bought it from here. <laughs> Red tail polo. What was that? Red tail. Oh, yeah, we have a red tail. I want to see one. I think there's guys over there if you want to take a look. I want to go take a look. Red tail polo. Yes, yeah. yeah. Okay. It's been doing good, and then I just want just that that was the person that I don't know why it's getting cloudy, but My I've been changing water like every week. You know? Okay. How much water do you change out? Oh, like one fourth of it. The fourth? Yeah, the fourth okay. of it. Yeah. My suspicion would be it's probably a bacterial one. Uh -huh. um, we'll take a look at this and see. Um, but when you have a new tank and you have fish that are coming in, uh -huh. um, a lot of times what will happen is if there's an excess of waste, so all of a sudden the bacteria are like, hey, this is awesome. I have a ton of food. Let's reproduce like crazy and let's start eating all this waste up. And that's where you start to see that white cloudiness. Oh. Yeah, and that you can see we've already got a little bit of ammonia. So a little bit of that waste that's probably feeding the bacteria for that food. Oh. Yeah, but we'll take a look at the rest and we'll see what's going on. When did you grab your fish? Uh, like maybe six, seven days later after we set up the tank. Okay. Yeah, fish been doing good, and we end up having a lot of babies in that tank also. Okay. So Are yeah. Are they guppies or? Yeah, okay. guppies. Yeah. Cool. Yes, he's got a YouTube channel, so... That's exciting. I have a 40 in this video. Wow, that's pretty cool. Oh my god, Squab is what I have though. Maybe... Um, 1700. No, I don't. I have 20,000. Oh, she's, she's gonna explain. She's gonna explain everything about this color, okay? So that your viewers can. Yes, yeah. What do you have from that one? Yes. Perfect. Okay. So basically what's going on is kind of what I suspected. There's just an excess of waste in the tank, uh -huh. which is just feeding that bacteria. The really good news though is that you actually, you do have nitrates. So okay. if you look over at this chart right here, you have both types of bacteria in your tank. Okay. So we've got both of them developing. They're just trying to catch up with this new bio load. Uh -huh. So what I'm going to recommend in the meantime is doing uh, about 25% water changes two times a week for right now. Okay. And then you'll notice, you said you have a bottle of Prime at home, right? Yes, yeah. Okay, so you can do up to three times the dose of Prime for the 29 gallons every 24 hours. Okay. And go ahead and do that for one week. And then we'll retest and see where things are at. What okay. that's going to do, so 
ammonia and nitrite are incredibly toxic for fish. That's where you run into a lot of deaths with fish when you have a new tank. That happened once. That happened once? That's okay. That sometimes does, but we'll get you on track. So what the prime's going to do is it's actually going to neutralize these, so to speak. It's going to make it so that that's not as big of an issue for the fish. Uh -huh. And then through your water changes, you're going to be pulling out these nice rates. So that water changes is going to bring the red down, and then the prime's going to neutralize these two for oh. you. So does that make sense? Yes, yes. Okay, perfect. I'm going to you happy now? Yeah. Yeah? Did she explain everything for you? Yeah. That's All what right. you wanted, right? Okay, cool.